Welcome to the Horizon Devices tutorial series. We hope you find your experience enlightening and you suffer minimal emotional trauma. This video is a general overview of how to properly set up the precision drive with your setup to begin melting faces as quickly as possible. The precision drive draws 9 volts of power, negative tip, which can be provided via most major power suppliers, or with a 9 volt battery, which can be accessed by removing the backplate. For best results, use an isolated power supply. Warning! Attempting to power with a potato may void your warranty. For maximum effectiveness, we recommend placing the precision drive in the front of your signal chain. The input labelled IN is for your guitar, and the output labelled OUT is to run to your amplifier, audio interface, or into other pedals. When using the pedal with a modeler, it's generally better to place the pedal in front of the unit, even if your unit has virtual loops, as those sometimes can introduce noise with gain pedals and mess with your gain setting. Either way works, but 9 times out of 10, plugging it in front will sound best. When using it with software amps, just plug into the pedal and then from the pedal out to your interface's line input. Having trouble with the precision drive? Fear not! We will cover the most common issues people encounter. Unwanted noise? Check to see if there's noise before you turn on the precision drive. If so, this means that it may be caused by your amp, cables or other pedals. Are you supplying the correct power to the pedal? Try using a 9 volt battery with the pedal, as this will tell you if the issue is stemming from your power supply, or try using a different pedal with the same power supply. Be conservative with your settings, and add more as needed. The precision drive goes much further than other pedals. Please be aware the precision drive is inherently designed to have higher headroom levels than a standard overdrive. For example, around 6 on our volume knob is the equivalent of a traditional OD at 10. So these not only go to 11, they go well beyond that. Start with a drive at 0, and the other knobs below 12 o'clock, and adjust to taste from there. Thank you for watching. Please join us for part two, where we'll show you how to use each knob on the precision drive to get your dream tone. Ta-ta!